In this video, we're going to show you how to hook up a Wide X TV play to the back of your television and how to pair the TV play to your Wide X devices. So the first picture you're seeing here is of the actual TV play device. We're going to pan to the right to show you the other things you're going to need. That is the digital audio out or optical cable that you're going to plug into the back of the TV play and the back of the television. The next item you see here, if you do not have a digital audio out, you most likely have a classic analog audio out, which is the red and white cable. The next thing you're going to need is a USB cable that's going to plug into the back of the TV play to provide it power. The next item here is a mount that you can use on the back of your television, which allows you to discreetly mount the TV play. And the last thing, if your television does not have a USB input, then you're going to need this plug and you're going to have to power the TV play that way. And lastly, you're going to need your White X 2.1 gigahertz Bluetooth hearing aids, which is either the Beyond model or the Evoke model. Okay, so the first step what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the TV play, we're going to take the digital audio link, we're going to plug that into the bottom here you want to make sure it's oriented correctly. Then you're going to plug that into the back of the television. I'm pointing over here. There we go. And it's going to be the digital audio out or optical audio out. So then you're going to connect the other portion here like so. Okay, the second step now is we're going to get the USB portion. We're going to plug the USB portion in the back here, and then plug the other part into a USB input, which would be right here. Okay, so I'm just gonna pick this one, plug that in securely. You will see a indicator light here that tells you that the device is receiving power. So the next step, what we're gonna wanna do is pair the hearing aids to the TV play. So battery doors were open, so you wanna bring it nice and close. Close the battery doors, one, two. Okay, so we're gonna take a look there at that indicator light. And then hopefully that will glow solid. There we go, it's got a blue, there we go, now a green. So now you are connected. And so the one last thing I'll show you while we pan out a little bit there is this mounting bracket. I'm not going to put it on the back of the television. I'm just gonna show you how this works. I'm gonna move the hearing aids here. There's an adhesive portion that you remove, and then you'll be able to take that and stick it on the back of your television here. Once you do that, then you're going to take the TV play, turn it around, and it actually works as such where you slide this in like this. Once you have that in there, then you'll be able to mount it to the back of your television, however you like it, and it's going to be nice and discreet. It's not uh, critical. You don't have to mount it, but some people like to. I hope this helps.